Hello, how is everybody fine? Yes. So we'll begin today with a clap because in the last class you scored hundred out of hundred. Yes, very good, very good, very good. Okay. Now, now you can see I have written a word here on the white board. What is it? Can you spell it? Come on. Geo. Spell it. A D J E C T I V E. Look at that. Then you can write A D J E C T I V E S. So what is the difference between adjective and adjectives? You know. Yes? This is singular and this is plural. English words, you know, you can make plural. Singular word you can make plural by writing S at the end of the singular. Suppose, boy, singular, isn't it? You can make it plural by writing an S at the end of that singular. So it becomes boys. So I wrote first adjective singular. Now I have made it plural by adding S. Okay. Very good. Very nice. Now what is an adjective? We saw nouns. What are nouns? Nouns are naming words. Now if you write, if you say like this, you know, uh, balloon. Balloon, yes. you say. <laughs> then you say temple. temple. Then you say horse. If you say like that, you know, the noun, the noun, there is, there is no light on the noun. You can say, there is no light, isn't it? There is no light. It looks what we, what we will say, dull, dull, dull. No, no light. So if you want to make it bright, brighter, bright, bright, you like a bright morning or a dull morning? A bright morning, of course. Or when you get up, suppose in the morning is very dull, cloudy, you will also become cloudy. But when you are bright, then <laughs> you like it, no? yes. like that. Now, all the nouns in the world means all the names in the world you can make bright how by adding by writing a bright word just before that just before that bright word these are adjectives now you see look at this now this if it's a balloon but if it's a red balloon huh now you <laughs> The full meaning of the balloon comes to you. Red balloon, yes. Look at that. So that red is adjective. You say red. See that. So the, a word that brightens a noun is an adjective. Or a word that describes. Describes. It describes a noun. That's the thing. So adjectives are describing words, describing words, they are describing words. This is the meaning of adjective. Or as I told you, brightening, bright, making bright. See, suppose you say, what is this? You say, it's a t-shirt. But if you, if you say, this a yellow t-shirt. The yesterday, you remember, I was wearing a red t-shirt with the stripes. This is too complicated, so don't worry. Today, I am wearing a yellow t-shirt. No, yellow t-shirt, yes. No, look very bright, yes. Like that, you can describe all the nouns. Adjectives, K 
can only describe nouns not any other thing any other thing mean there are many other things but <laughs> that we will see later but for the time being you understand only nouns understand and uh, adjectives are always written before the noun see here you can see now red now red balloon now is so red don't say balloon red this word as there you should say red balloon now like that t-shirt so the yellow t-shirt not a t-shirt yellow that you cannot say yes okay now let's start describing okay let us uh, you know some adjectives simple adjectives you know isn't it you have studied in your nursery yes twinkle twinkle little star oh, that's the thing little star yes so that is an adjective little little star say that don't say it star little little star so this is star is noun what noun is this come on quick yes common common countable singular noun yes so common countable singular noun little star small when you look up you find small die dot no so little star yes there is it now you can see do you find any little here in this ah here it is so little you can see no? little a little small little then also we can say small small baby or little baby yes so small baby so small is adjective because small brightens or describes baby noun what is baby yes common countable we don't know the gender so we don't just forget about that so we say common countable noun yes very good singular noun yes, singular noun yes very good so here now what does he want to describe look at this priest is he happy or unhappy happy means always laughing happy <laughs> see that uh, happy i am a happy teacher now <laughs> i am always happy yes. so you can say happy priest no that is another happy priest that is happy priest then what about this this girl here is she beautiful or ugly ugly means this beautiful right so what is what is what is beautiful as yes. so beautiful beautiful is it girl a beautiful not girl but lady okay lady lady means not a girl but that uh, like you are teachers now here yeah. are ladies yes. ladies so beautiful lady so now look at this these words no little small happy beautiful these are adjectives so just uh, you, you just imagine we are going to read this without this star baby priest lady okay that's no fun but when you see this brightening words or we say describing words the noun becomes what the noun has a what we must say greater meaning yes meaning now let's see again what about this aunt and uncle are they happy describe them happy they both are laughing this father and mother happy yes this lady here happy this student here ah look at this happy the doctor is very happy see because <laughs> yes he is doing it and nurse very very happy yes and this boy is very smart no saying goodbye smart smart means what very lively isn't it smart boy you can say smart boy so write down this these are adjectives smart boy so we have described all these people here 
Now let's say here, what about this? Happy girls, yes. Here, look at this. This cat is also very happy. No? Think he or the cat may be getting some milk now. It has seen some milk. So, chair, chair is, is it beautiful, happy, smart, little, but then it is a, what chair is it? Can you say computer chair? No? It is a, what chair? Revolving, yes, you can move like this. Revolving, ah, that's a big word, don't, don't, don't uh, study, don't think about that. This girl here, happy, yes. This crow here, crow, <laughs> very happy, because she may be thinking, and what this balls here, many colorful, yes, you can say color, color, colorful, C-O-L-O-U-R, F U L colorful, colorful no color 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 yes. colors yes the colorful 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 balls very good and then we come to elephants small or big big yes so that is another adjective big 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 elephants yes big big elephants okay how many adjectives today you have studied little small happy Beautiful, colorful, then you have got a big and a, what a big and only big. Colorful, I don't know. Here is colorful, yes. So we have described this. Now this is colorful, we can say, yes. So that is all. Okay. Now let us see here, temple. This temple, great. Yes, it's a great temple. You can say beautiful temple, you can great, great. G R E A T, great, great temple, isn't it? It's a great temple. The temple is a great one. No? See, you know, it can also say big, but it is great. Eh? Better to use great. G R E A T, a great temple. Yes. Then what about a temple? This kingfisher, smart. Ready to jump, smart, like the boy. What is smart means? Very I mean, active, active, yes. Uh, opposite of smart is dull. Dull people, they, 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 they walk like this. But smart people, like this, yeah, that is how they say. Then, aeroplane, wonderful, <laughs> wonderful, yes. Wonder, wonder, you know, wonder. You can say it's wonderful, yes. For us, it is wonderful. Isn't it? Wonderful, yes. It's wonderful. So wonderful. Uh, and this mother, very happy. Yes, with her. And uh, you can also say, with mother, you can say, you can use another adjective, pious. Pious. What is pious means? Pious. This is pious. Always moving. This. Mother is very pious. Yes. Then uh, bus. Uh, this is train, isn't it? The train. Train. You can say long. <laughs> it is long. Yes. So there you can say long train. L O N G. Long train. Yes. Understand? How many adjectives now you have studied? Long, long, long. L O N G, eh? write down. Long train. Then, this bird, this crow, attentive, big word. So don't worry, attentive. This door, door is set, set, what will, what will you say? Tall, you know, tall, tall. Yes. Is there any tall person here? No, no. Full name, don't know. So let's say tall. It's a tall, T A W tall. And we have color, colorful, yes. Here, we have got very smart. We're also very smart, we can say. Then yellow, yellow banana. Yellow. Y E L L O W. Yellow. See, here, smiling boy. Smiling. This is smiling. <laughs> 
smiling. When you see people, you should smile. Listen. Yes, smiling, smiling. Yes, M. Yes, have you taken all these things? Then, have you taken these adjectives? Yes. Okay, right. taken down. Yes, very good. So then I will. Okay. Yes, very good. Very nice. Yes. You yeah, are all very intelligent boys and girls. You, know. you are the best students in this school. Yes. In this school, you are the best. Ah, that we will we will see all those things later. Huh? What is meant by the best and and other things? So a smiling boy, it's a smiling, 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 always smiling boy, smiling boy. And this one, very alert, That's alert. Is it a big word for you? If it is big word, don't write down. Eh? Alert means active, ready to act. That is ready. To, eh? A lot. Yes, a lot. <laughs> yeah, then. Then you are here. Yeah, the beautiful flowers. Yes, we did. White rice. White. W H A T. White rice. Yes. Then. Mobile phone. Colorful. No? Colorful mobile phones. And you have got the. Loving grandparents. Loving. Yes. L O V I N G. Loving. They are loving, no? The grandparents are very loving. No? There's a small baby, this little one, they both of them are kissing. Like this. So you also, when you were small babies, your grandparents might have loved you like this, taken you in their bosom and uh, play, played with you and kissed you. Or that. So that is uh, very love. I see this again loving. This brother and sister. The brother is so loving, you know. Yes, loving. And then we have seen all those things. This also we have seen. Then, then, this is wheat. Golden. Golden, yes. So that is another adjective that you can see. Golden adjective. Golden, yes. Golden. Golden adjective. Then, this is, what is this? Sweet jam. Sweet. It's a sweet jam. Just a jam means could mean bitter also, opposite of that. Here, sweet sugar. Sugar is sweet. So, sweet sugar. You can say, is this, uh, what will you, what will you say this? What color is this? Yellow. So, yellow color. Yellow, yellow. Yellow bottle. You can say yellow bottle, oil. Eh? Then you have got, uh, what other things? Can you? We have described everything. Yeah. Yes. Here. Famous. Mohanlal. Famous. Yes. Famous. So, these are adjectives. Understand? Adjectives. Famous Mamuti. Yes. Famous Mohanlal. Famous Mamuti. Then famous Prime Minister. Very serious now. This, in this photo, Prime Minister Indaga is serious. S E R I O U S. Your headmaster is very serious, no? When you go to his room, he doesn't. He he will not say, Ah, come here. He say, Yes. What's the matter with you? He said, Very serious. But what about my <laughs> myself? I am always smiling, isn't it? Very friendly, and I am not at all serious, isn't it? I will say, Ah, why are you uh, struggling? Don't talk. Eh? Uh, you should uh, do all your exercises properly. That's all. Have I ever got angry with you? Yes? No, no, no. I will never get angry with you. <laughs> yes, I will never get angry. Don't worry. So that's another thing. Yes. So because I know you love me. And I know I love you. So why should I get angry with you? No. I will not do that. Okay. Then you have got... Uh, yes. This... Gentleman has come out. Why? This uh, not pasted properly. Yes. So you have got a red flower. Eh? It's a red beautiful flower. A bookshelf. A big bookshelf. Yes. You can have such. So a slim pencil. Slim. Slim. No. The, the pencil is slim. 
so i think you got no? you got the idea of adjective so this is the second class of words that we are studying what was the first one nouns what is the second one adjectives what do adjectives do with nouns adjectives brighten the noun yeah adjectives describe the noun so you call them describing words nouns are naming words adjectives are describing words yes you understand that? now you can use 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 any number of adjectives before a noun for so for example now you students now suppose i am going to describe all of you i will say smart beautiful handsome jolly happy then not sad not sad um studious how many now six studious then uh, uh, beautiful as smart as uh, clever intelligent boys and girls how many so eight adjectives i used so when you as i when you go to when, when after first standard we will be moving to second standard then you will you will use more adjectives when we move to third standard sometimes you will use three four adjectives with a noun when you move to fourth standard you will uh, use half a dozen adjectives to describe some things understand yes so in this little rhyme that you have studied song you know you remember humpty dumpty had a humpty dumpty had a great fall Well, great. Amdi Amdi had a great fall. Uh, Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown, and Jim came down, tumbling after. There's no adjective there. No adjective. Okay. So what the other one? Little, little. twinkle twinkle little star see how i wonder what you are up above the up above the what is the next one like a what is how did you how how do you end that song twinkle twinkle little star how i wonder what you are see that? up above the up above the sky so high like a diamond in the sky so high sky that is high sky do you get that when this so you are go through your rhymes nursery rhymes and see how now pick out all the nouns okay and pick out all the adjectives so that will be a project for for you project you know project project means uh, some work uh, some homework we call it project work so to make it great understand so don't worry about it but you should uh, try try what will you try go through all the nursery rhymes last year you st- that you studied last year and then what will you do make a list of nouns make a list of adjectives huh? that there is no description of adjectives like you masculine feminine neuter and all those things nothing but adjectives have got uh, opposites for as happy and happy beautiful ugly at that we will see later don't worry about that now now remember this much that is what what do you remember first you studied what naming words then now we are studying how to describe those naming words and those describing words are called in grammar adjective singular plural adjectives if there is only one adjective singular adjective then you are more now you can say more no? here are adjectives smiling alert loving serious famous sweet golden uh, what is this slim uh, yes it's very simple very simple is no problem 
How will you describe? Yes? Very good. So, come on, let's see this. How will you describe this? By using an adjective. He is very happy. Eh? But more than happy, he is doing some mimicry. <laughs> we will say, naughty. N-A-U-G-H-T-V. Everybody is, children are naughty, no? N-A-U-G-H-T-Y. Children are naughty. Means they always play some tricks and other things like that. In the class also you can so Children are playing. Uh, they are playing. They are naughty and they are, uh, what we must say, uh, doing some mischief. Mischief? You know what is mischief? So writing the name of a person and pasting it on his back and things like that. Nicknames. Uh, naughty. Mischief. So mischievous is adjective from that. So more, the, more of this we will see as we proceed to our second standard, third standard, fourth standard and so on. Till then, it's very good, very nice that you have done very, uh, or you have described all these things, you have studied some ten uh, new adjectives, isn't it? We have studied how many nouns? Plenty of them, all these are nouns. And then you have got the uh, adjectives, okay? So more adjectives, as I told you, a project work. <laughs> I'm going to give you a project work. What is the project work? Go through, read all the your nursery rhymes and then pick out, make a list of adjectives and then also what noun, nouns. Very good. Okay. Then, so all of you are done very well. You have uh, you have been listening very. What I must say. Uh, you are sharp listeners. Oh, no. See, look at that. I use the an adjective. Sharp listeners. If I say you are listeners, and I say sharp listeners, everybody is listening. Oh, I can hear it. So we see. So start tomorrow is Saturday. Saturday is a holiday. Sunday is another holiday. So you have plenty of time to do this homework. So do it and come back on Monday with greater energy. Oh, okay, fine.